is Alien Breed. This is the special edition they released uh, after uh, a few years after the first release. Uh, and uh, this this is uh, it's been a while since I did a retro game, isn't it? Especially an Amiga game. And this is one I did play in back in the old days. Uh, I never got very far with it because it's fucking hard. Anyway, let's get into it. Shuttle Bay 2, Deck 1. Upon leaving your craft, perform a reser of the immediate area. Reese, I never heard that word. <laughs> is, it, is it a Kyle Reese? <laughs> uh, locate deck lift that leads to the power subsystem and proceed further into the heart of the station. Radar, re radar reports little movement, but some near vents. And I didn't have enough time to read all that. <laughs> I was trying to be dramatic, damn it. Whatever. Okay, so, it's a, as you can see, it's a top down uh, shoot game, and oh, uh, yeah. So look at these. Uh, I can't get through there. I, miss, I need to find a key. Yes, key, key. Okay, but look at this. I've got this cool ship. And I don't get to fly it ever. <laughs> I just, I just, flying the cool ship is ended. Now you're walking about. That's too bad. But I have a machine gun, so that's cool. <laughs> and the, of course, this obligatory Star Trek noises. Ah, yes, money. The uh, fire door. I guess it's going to close in the event of fire. Maybe I should go up here first. What's this? Can I use this? Oh no. Oh, I can. Intex Connect code something. 2.5 gig RAM. That's not bad. <laughs> Actually, it's pretty bad for. Oh look, I got. Yeah, one thing that's cool about this is you can uh, you can buy new weapons. Of course, my credit limit is 200, and even the sim smallest guns cost fuckloads. But laser spelt wrong. Damn it! No, I won't purchase a laser that's spelt wrong. <laughs> it's an acronym. It's not. a Word. Well, it is a word. You know what I mean. Let's see. Oh, additional life. God, they're so expensive. Key packs. Yeah. This. I can't, don't know if this was in the original one. Oh, that's cool. I get a map. Yeah, I don't remember too much about this. I may have played the the uh, the non the unspecial edition. Which objective? Oh, I can read this now. Control advises maximum use of any available resources left by the station's previous occupants. Right. Got to go through their fridges and. Uh, oh, Intex Entertainment Subsystem Inaccessible, Unit Under Refurbishment. <laughs> Game stats. Yeah, this isn't going to be very interesting. Shots fired six. Useless. Okay. Uh, info base. Online help. <laughs> Intex are pleased to supply all station officers and blah blah blah. The station is a base for preparatory science and experiments and. Yeah, this is a bit a bit dry. Let's get back to the shooting aliens. Oh yeah, there are aliens in this, as if you couldn't tell by the title. Disconnecting. Okay. So hopefully I can go back there when I've got some money and buy... Uh, buy whoa. Oh god, there's a little slope there. Uh, so I completely spaced on what that map said, but whatever. This game is really quite thick with atmosphere and... Oh dear. Yeah. Um... Obviously, very heavily inspired by the uh, alien films, and uh, you know the Colonial Marines sort of thing, and it does have that sort of atmosphere to it. I don't know why they write. <laughs> it's so strange. They write the signs on the floor, and they're all facing the same way. Uh, you know, it's just, it's, I know it's a. Um, <laughs> oh, look, stuff. All the things. This looks like first aid. Don't need that. Med kit. No. Okay, that's too bad. I didn't get hurt enough to need it. <laughs> and of course, it's one of these games where you pick it up and use it immediately. You can't just put it in your pocket. Although you do seem to be able to carry enough ammo and other guns and things, but you can't carry a med kit. Yeah. So uh, there, there, there you go. There's the problem with this game: is the respawning enemies uh, and limited ammo. That is a bad combination. <laughs> I mean, it does sort of add to the desperation and difficulty of the game, but retro games didn't really need that much uh, increase of the difficulty, if you ask me. Uh, this is a problem with us. Oh, look, it's right there again, immediately. This is such a problem with, with old games. That I, oh, God. You see, ah, you, can, you, can be, you barely have time to kill them before they, you know, because in, in the later... Uh, I don't know if it was Alien Breed 2 or Alien Breed Tower Assault. 
but you could uh, walk backwards slowly while firing, which of course is a staple of all first-person shooters these days. You're always bunny hopping and jumping backwards, and, and uh, oh, there's so many of them. Fortunately, they're pretty slow compared to the. Is this a lift? Huh. No, that's a lift over there. Okay. So that's useless. Oh god, and then they come. I don't know if they just stop following me after they get off screen. Maybe. But it's uh, it's a really cool looking game. Uh, it's got a very Amiga look to it, which I like. It is kind of spooky with that constant vroom, vroom, vroom. Now, the thing is about keys. There's three keys in there. And I ha do I have three keys? Let's see. Because keys at the top I have two, so I'll waste all my keys and not get any back if I go up there. <laughs> These, like, oh, there's a key down here. Uh, these kind of uh, consumable keys never made much sense to me. Oh, look, it's the other, the other ship. Yeah, one thing that's cool about this game is you can play it with two players. I can't remember if it's split screen or if you start on different, or if you're just on the same screen. Um, but it's pretty cool that you can play in co-op. Um, how much money do I have now, I wonder? Oh, God. See, where did that come from? It's ridiculous. This game would have been challenging enough without that. It could like be a difficulty setting or something. Why can't it be that? But look, I. Uh... So it, I think I have regenerating ammo. No, that was just like slowly showing the. Uh... See, it's pointless trying to kill him. <laughs> the game shouldn't discourage you from killing. Uh, let's see, one key there, two keys there, three here. Right, is it worth going up there? There's one. Ki ah! See, if you even touch it. Okay. Now, if I. Oh, look. Gold bars. Yeah. Oh, wow. I could I could actually buy a new gun for this. That's cool. I don't remember ever really doing well enough to. Uh, to get. Oh, let's see if I can see what's in the other rooms from here. Some money. So it, it kind of becomes a bit of this. This key bollocks situation is kind of annoying. I suppose it's cool that you can buy key packs in the in the thing, but seriously, who designs a consumable key? It's like it's ridiculous. But it seems to be a staple of these uh, these old games. I mean, looking back on it now, you can kind of see the mistakes, but what we call mistakes, just... Welcome to the um, tech system. Okay, let's see, how much money... Ah, oh, I don't have enough money for anything. Okay, never mind. I'm getting close, though. I'm probably not going to find any of those gold bars anytime soon. <laughs> can you imagine? It's like, a, it's like one of those self-checkout things. You just... You, you pay so much, you're just piling gold and jewels into the thing. Uh, there's money for here, let's take it. Uh, but see, the thing is, I can't even see up there. If I, no, that's a bad idea. That's not worth two keys. Um, yeah. I think I should wait until I've unlocked the more vital areas I need to to progress before I do that sort of thing. Uh, I don't need that, but I gotta. Yeah. Yeah. It's just first aid, immediate aid. Not even very aiding. Uh, yeah, there, there is a map, but you need to like buy the map program. Like, this dickhead didn't bring a bloody. Wait a minute, have I been everywhere now? Let's check the map. I can check the map over here, can't I? You could, couldn't even just print. There's no print button on this. It's, it's finally become a paperless Welcome society. To you have to buy a bloody PDA or whatever. Uh, Text radar, is that it? Okay. Um, right, this has four. There's four doors at the top there. So, uh, I've got to get. Oh, I've got to get through those. Just right above me, there's two, then three, then two more. And I may have already run out of enough. I can't even. <laughs> my, uh, hang on. No, never mind. My fraps, uh, capture thing is covering up the top of that so I can't see if uh, let's just hope there are some keys in here there's one okay and I made it yes good and I can go through there and lose a key and get a key what is the point 
Whoop. Yeah, and I, I think the there are like different varieties of aliens later on. Ah. But it, you know, it was quite rare for there to be co-op games like this back in the day. So this is pretty cool that you could do that. Of course, it's just me this time. Oh, look at them all. Ugh. Alien bastards. What are you doing here? What do you want? Take me to your lizard. Do you have a lizard? Damn it. See, if, if they're going to regenerate just every time I walk around the corner, then... Ah. I'm doing alright, though. Oh, God. Gold. No. Oh. Okay, well, I avoided having to use those keys there. That's cool. And deck lift. Here we go. Oh, don't I look awesome from the side? It's too bad you only see me from the top most of the time.